So then how do you feel about other platforms coming up in the city? I love it. I love it, man. I love it. Um, I think the biggest thing is that we just got to, I don't want to use the word unify because to me, we all know how it goes, especially if you're an artist or anything in the city, the whole, we got to bring the city together. The shit's not realistic, man. Like, it's not. You know what I mean? Right. Like, everybody has their own agendas. Everybody has their different, their focuses and their goals. We don't have to bring the city together. But we do have to realize that we're all after a common goal. So everybody plays a piece in that goal. And so that's a lot of what we're trying to do with the um, the plug agency as far as, like, just developing and helping produce podcasts is, okay, if everybody's going to start having podcasts in the city, let's find a little bit of, like, fluidity be- between it. You know what I mean? Like, all right, shit, you might be over here. Shit, you might be at Bright Future, but you might need X, Y, Z from over here. And you might, like, we all doing the same right. shit. So it's like we might as well not counteract each other. Let's try to make this shit make sense. And I like I like seeing new platforms come up because I can't do all this shit. Like, I've tried to have four different shows where I'm on all them motherfuckers, man. Shout to Washed and the check-in. And, like, I see these visions creatively. I'm like, oh, this could be dope. But then I can't find the personalities to host, so I just plug myself into that shit. <laughs> and now I'm wearing 16 different hats. Right. Whereas there's somebody like you, and I'm like, all right, this this opportunity would be dope. Instead of me trying to build it, bring that shit to street nerds. You know what I mean? Like, we create this collective, and that's how you really move. And I, yeah. I learned that shit a lot because I've been going back and forth uh, to Atlanta now. And I'm just like, damn, man, you go downtown, you walk down the street, it's CNN, it's NBC, it's ESPN, it's TNT. What? You know what I'm saying? Just buildings on buildings. Buildings on buildings. Studios. And they all doing they, they shit in their lane with their crew and everybody's getting paid. But it's all at the end of the day. It's either Viacom. It's, you know what I mean? These right. are all under one shit, but everybody's doing their thing. They own shit. Denver doesn't think like that. And that's that's what I'm trying to get people on, bro. Like, it's it's much bigger than, oh, this nigga's doing that. So let me stun on him and do this. It's not, nah, man. We all doing the same shit at the end of the day. What wisdom would you give up and coming platforms? Or what would you say to the young man who's like in high school right now, um, thinking about college, wanting to get into media, seeing what everybody's doing with the streaming and talking and podcasting? What is the biggest gem that you can give them? My main thing, man, with media is branding is everything. Not even just media, period. Branding is everything, especially with podcasts. Um, with this big podcast boom and everybody having a podcast, I say podcast is just an extension of your personal brand, man. I say that all the time. Um, if you don't have a personal brand or you don't have something outside of that podcast that's going to attract people to your platform, you might as well not fuck with it. Because if I go on Apple Podcasts right now and just put in hip hop podcast, I'm going to get 16 million different shits. I'm likely to either click the one that's hosted by somebody I already recognize or a brand that's associated with something I already like. I'm mm. not about to just click some random shit. You know what I mean? So if you don't have that brand and you don't have your marketing straight, you know, that goes for podcasting, that goes for music, that goes for whatever. It's like you might as well just go try to go get a job somewhere, like that, which is cool. You know what I mean? Go do broadcasting, Nine News or some shit like that. But if you're doing an independent platform, you got to have a brand, man. Like people got to fuck with you, and then they'll listen to you. That's what I would say. 